What's up, what's up, what's up? It's your boy DC Too Cool back in for another video. Today's topic, once again, is Dragon Ball Z Universe 2. You already know how I do. Uh, primary content on the channel. Big Z Universe 2 fan, big Dragon Ball fan in general. Um, anime fan, of course. Creating and writing my own manga, Japanese flavored American comic on Webtoons, The Twelfth Disciple. Link will be in the description if you're interested. Um, check it out. So, Xenoverse 2, we have official confirmation from the new Kantan City TV that Jiren, full power, Mr. Buff, Mr. Shirt Rip, himself, is coming to Xenoverse 2. So, I hear some people complaining and thinking he should be a free character and things like that, but, um, and I apologize if you hear things in the background. Uh, it's 4th of July weekend, some people are going crazy with the fireworks, so please bear with me. Um, you know, these kids, they be popping stuff all weekend. So, some people have a problem with this, think that, oh, he's going to be a reskin, and he's already in the game, he should be free. I don't get people. If you've been playing Xenoverse 2 for as many times, many times, as long as I have, since day one pretty much, and still here, you should know by now, when they add a new character to the game, as far as a premium character, paid character, they are not reskins. The fact that people still say this shows how ignorant you are and shows that you don't play this this game. I had a, you know, a conversation with a friend. He's a Xenoverse 2 hater, though. Oh, you're paying for a reskin. You're paying for this and that. No. And the same dude loves Dragon Ball Fighters. Bro, didn't you pay for another Goku? Another Vegeta? Three or four times? There's like five Gokus in that game. Goku Black. Base form Goku. Uh, Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan Blue Goku, uh, Gogeta, which is half of Goku, um, Ultra Instinct Goku, GT Goku, like, stop the cap. Anyway, so, so he's not going to be a reskin. If you need hard evidence of this, look at the Vegeta pack. Go back to the DLC, what was it, 9, I believe? And people was like, oh, Vegeta, he's going to be a rescan. Two Vegetas, they're going to play the same way. They're just doing transformations. Eh, wrong. Vegeta, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan, Evolution, Blue, and Vegeta, Super Saiyan God, or Red, were completely different. They play completely different than every other Vegeta in the game and play completely different from each other. So, again, he's not going to be a rescan. Any premium character is not a rescan. If it's a free character, they'll add them to their existing characters in the palette like they are, like they did with Super Saiyan Blue, uh, Goku when he had the different gears or whatever in the Goku Black Saga. And maybe add a move or two that's different as far as his ultimate or something like that. That's their actual, you know, rescan or whatever. But those are actually, you know, actual free uh, swaps or whatever. They're not actually characters. They're not considered actual characters, unique characters. They're just costumes. So, I understand what you're talking about if you want me to ring your mouth about the game. Because most of y'all don't know what we're talking about. So, this game is dropping Jiren. More than likely, Ultra Instinct Goku will be the winner of the tournament. I'm sorry, of the voting system. We pretty much all predicted that anyway. Because, you know, again, you put Goku in anything, he's going to win 9.9 .9 times out of 10. And Vegeta's going to be a close runner-up. So, it's looking all but confirmed. Um, they might get three characters, you might get two. Um, we don't know, but hopefully, um, we go ahead and get that sooner rather than later. It's supposed to be out in the fall. Hopefully, it's early fall, maybe September, October. I personally don't want to wait, um, you know, personally. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to see what else they drop. I mean, it seems like Xenoverse 2 is starting to realize um, quality features. Like the stylus feature last last update. If they're going to do some more stuff like that, um, the quality features... Even the content CD TV, where it actually tells you, you know, the updates stuff like that, and you got to worry about running the, the V jump and the hunting stuff down on the internet, it's going to show you. That's those those are quality of life features. And if they keep this up, this is going to be, you know, this is this is good for the for the game. Like you should have came, these kind of features should have came a long time ago. So we'll see how things go going forward. Hopefully, um, ultra interesting Goku. Uh, some people want him to be a um, you know, again. Um, a free palette. I want to be original character. I want to be a premium character because I'll tell you why. He's going to have original moves. And those, some people will say, well, he plays the same as the other version. No, he doesn't. Go back and watch the anime again. 
He has moves, a bunch of different moves, and he fought a different way before he mastered his alter instinct or whatever. And go back and watch. So I want that stuff in the game. For my creative character. Forget him. I want the creative stuff for my creative character. So, you know, yeah. He, I believe he's going to be an original character, um, in my opinion. So, that's pretty much it for me. Um, we get another update, some more information. I'll let you guys know. Um, to the next video, people messing with me. Um, leave me alone, y'all. Um, to the next video, I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for watching. Again, check out the manga, read the manga, webtoons.com. Link will be in the description. Tell me what you guys think. Love feedback. Um, rate, subscribe, like, the whole nine. Um, till next time, y'all. Peace out.